created this because my mother, after the Moore tornado, which wiped out all of Moore, uh, wanted something to be feel safe in. She lives out in the country. We can barely hear the tornado sirens. So, my my friend and I, Jim Thompson, we started we started going to the drawing boards, and uh, we came up with the underground shelter. And so, our underground shelter, which is at Easton Sod Store in um, in Glenpool, was one of our demos that we took down to Texas Tech for our testing. This is our round unit. This is a five foot round unit, six foot tall. This tested beyond what everything we could imagine. The, the two, two by fours, which they call them missiles, were shooting out 100 miles an hour, which were equal to 250 mile an hour winds, which is a F5 tornado. And so they shot it four different times. We have three uh, dents that were five eighths deep on the door. Around this corner, we have a dent that was one inch that that when the two by four hit it, it shot back and bent the shroud around the cannon at Texas Tech University, which they weren't very happy about that, but we already told them we already had the check made out, so there's no, no extras. So this is actually our demo from Texas Tech. We have our square demo at Glenpool. We are gonna take this to Easton Sod Farm uh, store in Oklahoma City on the Broadway extension. Uh, so it will be at Tornado Alley for all the, the Oklahoma City Metro people to come and look at and see. Actually, this is, this is the test that we went through with Texas Tech to be certified. And then if you're in the Tulsa market, you can go to Glenpool store on Highway 75 and look at our other unit that we had tested with Texas Tech. Let's take a look. All right. So this is what we call a four person, two dog. So we have benches inside of it. We also have vents. We have bars that come in. Once, once this locks in, they go across this right here to lock it in. We also have, in our manufacturing now, we have escape hatches uh, in the top of them that you, you can't even notice. It uh, has a, a three-step ladder that's mounted on the interior for easy access. If debris uh, gets on the outside, you, you can at least get out. Uh, now, everybody that buys a storm shelter, whatever town you live in, um, you're registering with the fire department. So if there is a F, from F0 to F5 that comes through, at least they'll have some paperwork if the fire department's not uh, wiped out to see if you're still there. So um, anyway, we're excited about this new business and uh, we're, we're really in the saving lives business. And uh, everybody, this is a $4,500 unit installed. And if your family's not worth $4,500, that's the question you need to ask yourself. What's $4,500 for your loved ones to be safe and your animals? Well, and you said in an emergency, uh, you can actually fit more people in there. Yeah, in an emergency, I mean, how, how many people are on the outside trying to get in? So you can set your you? own Guinness Book of World Records <laughs> on the most people in a, a round five tornado tamer storm shelter. And it can have lighting, right? Yes. Yeah, your electricians can run lighting. We also offer uh, some battery-powered backup seats. lighting. The, si the seats, uh, you can have seats or you don't have to have seats. The seats are extra. Um, so it's really, we, can, we customize these to whatever your design. Our underground units, we really call them luxury safe rooms because we rubber coat the, the, the surrounding of it. When we sink it in the ground, we pour we pour two feet of con con or two yards of concrete where you don't even see the concrete. Bury it back. All you see is the exposed door. Alrighty. So we we really feel like we're building a superior unit. Um, our, our units, when our Oklahoma ground starts shifting, if it's a underground unit, our unit's not going to crack and you're not going to get water in it like a like a lot of other units out there are. So. Everybody that lives in Oklahoma, you know how much our ground cracks and we're gonna be uh, leak free.